hello ladies thank you so much for tuning into my channel and once again uh, welcome to another video and this video is about um, my experience with a Louis Vuitton bag which I purchased from Auckland and New Zealand and I was in that country where the uh, handgun shooting competition was held and uh, it was run about October uh, 2013 and um, before I went home I decided to buy a souvenir item from the brand so uh, since the store was uh, located in front of uh, our hotel and uh, when I entered I saw this bag so I decided to <laughs> well enough for the rumbling and yes uh, this is the one I'm referring to it's the Louis Vuitton um, monogram Matisse Hobo. So as you can see, it's already uh, used. <laughs> yes, because six years in my possession. And uh, but the leather, uh, I'm sorry, the canvas, monogram canvas is still in good condition. There's no glazing issues here on this side and on the other side there so uh the canvas is still okay and uh, it has also a pocket here that's why it's called uh, metis uh, only it's a hobo so if you want to open it you just have to press the the it's a little harder yeah because there's no nothing inside and uh, there you go, the packet here, it says uh, Louis Vuitton. Oh, let me see. Where is this made? Okay, Louis Vuitton, Paris, made in France. And now, uh, there is this uh, nice handle. And as you can see, there's already a patina on the bachetta or bachetta leather and including here uh it's in gold hardware with a handle like this um this is a uh, removable i guess yes this is removable as well so you can replace it with another handle and this one too is uh oh this one too is also removable this uh handle here and inside, uh, there's one pocket on this part, on the side. Let me open. Here. And then, on the other side, there are two uh, slip pockets. Here. Oh, I don't know if you can see. So this one. These ones are slip pockets. And uh, aside from that, uh, there's no uh, other pockets and this is the bottom part so it's still uh, in good condition but uh, there's the, the gold hardware here the gold here uh, is a little bit faded it has faded uh, a bit but it's just a uh, tiny fading and uh, in here as well so it's a little bit faded as well as on this side here I won't go uh, in detail uh, because as I said it's not a review because this bag is already discontinued and uh, I believe it's only a uh, limited edition. I don't know. Please correct me <laughs> if I'm wrong. And But you can still see uh, these bags in uh, the pre-love market. And um, let's check what fits inside. So I have here, since it's a hobo, uh, I have here... Uh, this organizer it's only a local organized bag organizer and um 
I have here a what is this? Uh, Guerlain uh, pressed powder there. I also have uh, my favorite, one of my favorite uh, lipstick lipsticks, which is the Tom Ford, and uh, it's lip color matte. Uh, Pussycat, yeah. And uh, let me show you the shade. So it's like a, a nude, uh, pinkish, nudish shade. I also have another lipstick here, which is the Chanel. And the shade is like a brownish. Uh, nude beige color and uh, my favorite uh, red lipstick from Smashbox can't see the print anymore <laughs> I can't read but the color is uh, like rouge red and uh, this is matte and I also have a blotting paper there I have here a uh, Jo Malone perfume um, it's called Mimosa and card cardamom or card cardamom cologne there you go so this is a travel size and I have here a sanitizer I also have uh, my nail oil or yeah my nail oil or cuticle oil I have a uh, uh, what's this floss and a bit of powder loose powder so I have here a mint mint uh, uh, super mint sugar free it's a mint candy I also have have here another uh, Marks and Spencer strong mints it's a candy mint and a hand cream which is uh, called cherry blossom from L'Occitan and my medicine okay so what else okay so I will be um, putting this as well my card my coin purse card holder coin purse slash uh, card holder and my uh, wallet as well <laughs> there so what's inside my wallet it's just nothing uh, bills receipts coins so <clears throat> excuse me there you go and uh, can also add or put uh, one of my uh, it's called one of my shades or sunnies uh, it's Ralph, Ralph Lauren there what else so I think uh, this is enough this is how it looks so you can wear this bag uh, by just holding this strap there or like that or on your shoulder excuse my excuse my 
on and gone. Um, you can you can uh, put your cell phone here, or this is strap. Okay, now <clears throat> I don't know if I can, uh, but I haven't tried uh, using this for, uh, for a crossbody. But let's try. But you can, there are still uh, three holes. No, definitely I cannot, so unless I adjust this. So if you can see, there are still uh, one, two, three holes uh, where I can adjust the strap for. Uh, the coarse body yeah I like this bag I love it uh, for travel because it fits uh, everything I need inside my uh, personal essentials the only issue I have with this bag is uh, the glazing on the handle on this part and as you can see it's already uh, down. It's already gone. <laughs> I mean the the uh, the the sides. And I decided to um, one time to approach uh, an SA in a Louis Vuitton store here in, in our country in our place. But I was told that I have to um, return this bag for possible repair or replacement. I don't know. And uh, that means I have to to uh, ship it uh, back to uh, New Zealand. <laughs> so it would cost me a lot because you know ship shipping cost here is uh, very uh, very high. So I just uh, I decided to not uh, ship it back, and instead I am planning to buy a new strap. Um, and if there's no uh, strap like this one available, so I might as well uh, ask for an assistant from Louis Vuitton here to uh, uh, recommend a particular strap uh, for this handbag. So there you go, guys. Um, let me know if you also have an experience uh, like this. And if you have a uh, handbag like this, the, the Louis Vuitton um, monogram Metis Hobo. So let me know in the comment section uh, down below. So guys, thank you so much. This is it for my, uh, uh, for, the, for, for the bag that I shared with you today. And I hope to share more in the future. And again, thank you so much uh, to my returning subscribers. And for those who are new to my channel, please... Uh, don't forget to subscribe, uh, like if you like this uh, kind of videos, and um, uh, don't forget to leave your comments down below as well. Until next video, bye!